Hey guys, I'm Christy Wright and welcome to our weekly coaching tip. I wanna give you a tip today that's going to help you create content. Now you guys probably know content is really important to your business. This is how you add value to your customers, especially in social media. But where does content come from? Well, I'm gonna give you a few options today. There are three options of how you can add value to your customers. Let's look at option number one. Option number one is where you actually create the content yourself. You think of the ideas and you write them down. Now, if you're a creative person, you're gonna love this. This is exactly how I am and I have 100 ideas a minute. In fact, I usually can't write them down on my phone fast enough. I have ideas all the time and I've gotta capture them or they're gone. Now, if you're like this, if you're a creative person, you want to capture ideas and build them out. You may have a seed of an idea, but you need to build it out into a blog post or a video or a script. You wanna make sure you're adding value to your customers. Now let's look at the opposite extreme. Let's say you're not a creative and you're thinking, you know what? I don't really have a lot of original ideas. That's not a bad thing. You're probably more technical and to be honest, you're better at follow through and things that I'm bad at. But here's the good news. You can still add value to your customers' lives. Instead of creating content, you're going to curate content. Now I've talked about this before in a previous YouTube coaching tip. What I want you to do is gather content, whether it's articles or books or videos from people that you know and like and follow and trust, and you use those to send out to your customers. Now, of course, you wanna give credit there. Don't act like they're yours when they're not. But when you begin to gather content from trusted places and send them out to your audience, your audience not only gains value, but they thank you for it because you're the one that sent it out. So we've got two extremes here. You can create the content yourself, or you can curate content, but there's also a middle ground. Maybe you have some ideas, but not a ton. Well, here's the good news. You can gather ideas from other people, but then you build them out yourself. You add to them, add your stories, your anecdotes, your analogies, your examples. As you begin to build on those ideas, they become your own. So you use that for inspiration, but then you add your voice to it. So you've got a few options when it comes to creating content. You can create it yourself, you can curate it from other people, or you can gather ideas and build them out yourself. I hope this encourages you because it gives you several options when it comes to creating content. Hey guys, thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel so you stay up to date on all of my coaching tips. And also, if you need more help with this when it comes to creating content, I've got two podcast episodes that give you a deep dive on how to be a better communicator. Check out episode 25 and 26 of the Business Boutique Podcast.